Hi guys, it's Bam Bam and welcome back. Today's video is another benchmark. This time I'll be putting Shadow of Mordor through the 5K test. Now that's 5K at native resolution, which is 5120 by 2880. I'll be using two of NVIDIA's latest Pascal Tynex graphics cards and this game will be running at ultra settings. Let's see how she does. As always guys, I'm now gonna show you the in-game options. If you want any information about the overclock I'm running or the rig I've got, you can find that in the description below. For anyone who's curious, at the end of this 5K benchmark, I will be running a 1440p benchmark. So stick around if you want to check out the information for that. So if we go into options, then go into video. As you can see, I'm running native 5K 5120 by 2880. I've got no FPS limit and I've got the VSync turned off. So if we go into the advanced settings, everything here is maxed out. I've got everything ultra. Lighting quality high as far as it goes. I've got anti-aliasing turned off. You do not need that in 5K at all. But everything else is as far up as it will go. Let's check out the benchmark. And there you have it guys, once again, these cards deliver fantastic performance. That benchmark was at 5K ultra setting and we were comfortably over 60 frames per second throughout. As promised guys, stick around for the 1440p benchmark which will run now. I was going to do a 4K one but for some reason the resolution wasn't available in the options. I will have to probably come back and revisit this at some point because I know you guys would want to see a 4K benchmark. But for now, it's just 5K and 1440p. Hope you enjoy it.